Next up, we're uh, hitting the road to see Goblin Valley State Park and then on to Moab for Arches and Canyonlands. way to see Goblin Valley and a little guy was interested in the Earth River machine. I like where the rocks were. I like some neat little rooms in there. I was told the kids would enjoy Goblin Valley and people were right. It is the middle of the day of June though, so, and we had no sunscreen on, so we just kind of ran through and enjoyed what we could for the $13 entrance fee. It's kind of like no place else I've ever seen like this. If you're on your way from Capitol Reef to, uh, Arches? Arches, Canyonlands, Moab basically, then why not stop over here? It's about a 10 mile detour maybe. As long as it's not busy, you should be able to get your motorhome up here. There is bus parking. Um, if it is busy then I guess I would ask at the visitor center before you pull all the way through here and find out you can't even park. But especially later in the day or at night when the sky lights up, because I'm sure it's very dark, fairly dark out here, I'm sure it'd be a whole lot of fun just to explore Something else interesting is that the uh, the park is totally off the grid, so I think they used all solar power. Stop that's worth it while you're out here in the southwest to the uh, park that everyone else calls Goblin Valley, but we're going to name it by the earlier name of Mushrooms. So we visited the mushrooms today. They look more like mushrooms than goblins. Yeah, I'd agree. I think they yeah. look like mushrooms. Yeah. So on to the road and to Moab, Arches and Canyon. or almost in Arches. So we got to Archview Campground about five. Got dinner started in the Instant Pot and we're gonna see if we can see the visitor center. The park is shut down from 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. because of construction.
let's go. That actually turned out okay. We got here and we thought the visitor center was closed at 5.30, but then there was a seven o'clock evening program. So we got to check off a junior ranger program. So thank you, Ranger Mike, for the astronomy talk. Well, we're gonna get here tomorrow early. <laughs> See if we get here at seven, that's the plan. And another very helpful ranger, she helped me figure out an itinerary for tomorrow. So we're gonna get here hopefully by seven and we will see if we can get some hikes. Now we're going delirious. Yay! <laughs> and uh, we're gonna try and feed him and throw him in the pool. Can we roll down our windows? Yeah, can we? 